गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग बेटा आर यू फीलिंग स्लीपी नो मैम नो गुड देन ओपन योर कैमरा गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग बेटा गुड मॉर्निंग गुड मॉर्निंग मैम गुड मॉर्निंग Open your cameras, all of you. Good morning, ma'am. Ma'am. Good morning. Good morning. Everybody, good morning. <coughs> all are ready with your GK books. Hmm? Are you all ready? Yes, ma'am. Very nice. Very good. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma good, beta. Good. Okay. Everybody, open your book to page number fifty-one. Open. and everybody open your cameras too how will i be able to see you what you are doing all yes ma'am i open yes good utkarsh yadav yuvraj gupta athar singh everyone open your cameras Open page number fifty one of your books. Okay. Let's begin. Can you see this grid made? Can you see this grid? now see go through the grid very carefully see what is written what all alphabets are written in each row and each column okay just go through it once Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, Vita. Good morning. Good morning, ma'am. Good bit. Good morning, Vita. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to everyone. Okay. So. Good. Ready to begin? Anyone has done yes, this page? Has anyone done this page before? Yes, ma'am. Oh, you've already done it. No, ma'am. I have not done it. I have done the fifty page number. Fifty? No. I'm talking about fifty one. Okay, so we are doing it for the first time, and good that you have not done it. All right. Now. what is the first question the first question is which row now what are rows rows are from top to bottom those are rows what are rows what what is a column and what is a row yes akshadha ma'am uh, i know only what are rows Okay, what are rows? Ma'am, rows are up to bottom. Yes, from top to bottom are rows, and from right to left or from left to right are what columns? Those are columns. So, which row of letters has all the vowels? now each row and each column has been given a number you can see number 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 each row has a number each column has a number 
now you have to tell which row of letters has all the vowels let's see let's try to find it out ma'am which page number beta page ma number 51 page, page number 51 okay ma'am Ma'am, we have done. Uh, yes. Ma'am, we have done. Know your numbers. Know your numbers. No, but no love. Have we done this? Know your numbers. No, ma'am. Okay, page number fifteen. No, ma'am. Let's no, ma'am. Let's do page number fifty now. Fifty. Let's begin with page number fifty. I thought we have done it. Okay. Ma'am, which page number? Page number fifty. Five zero fifty. Know your numbers. Okay, what is the first one? Fifteen into five. What is that number? Fifteen into five. Seventy-five. Let please tell what we are doing. That's great. Beta, we are doing. We are doing GK today. This is your GK period. Seventy-five. What is? And we are doing page number five zero fifty. Man, seventy-five. Yes. So write down seventy five over there. Seven five seventy five. Then what is number two? The one that is written on down. What is that? Five thousand plus four hundred plus sixteen plus eight. What What is the answer? Ma'am, five thousand four hundred sixty-eight. Yes, five thousand four hundred and sixty-eight. But they have not given any space to write eight, isn't it? Ma'am, boxes me like no. Ma yes, the fourth box is not made. Is it made in your book? Yes, ma'am. In my yes, book, it is not made. In my book, it is not made. The fourth block is not made. No problem. Just write it like that. Five, four, six, eight. Then come on to the above, the third one, across. Now, what is across? Across means this. Six sixty minus six. What is six hundred and sixty minus six? Then six hundred and forty-five. No. Six hundred and fifty-four. Yes. Six hundred and fifty-four. Okay. Then four, four down. Six hundred and sixty-six. Beta, it's not addition; it's subtraction. If you minus six from six hundred and sixty, it becomes six hundred and fifty-four. Okay. Then the fourth one, two forty-two into two plus twelve. Tell me, what is the number? Four hundred ninety-six. Four hundred ninety-six. Four hundred ninety-six. Yes, ma'am. Do it. Ma'am, excuse me. Yes. 
when there is only three blank spots per second bounce so what i do just write it below 6 just write it okay. below 6 okay okay ma'am yes okay. ma'am please tell all the answer again in the first two blanks you have to write 7575 <coughs> in the second one you have to write 5 the one that is coming down you have to write 5468 then the third one that is going across you have to write 654 <laughs> and the fourth one that is coming down there you have to write 496 496 then coming on to the second one everyone has done this yes ma'am Okay. Ma'am, what is yes, ma'am? Ma'am, ma what is the answer of first three box? Better the answer of first three blocks is. Which are the first three blocks? Which one are you asking? Across or down? Tell me which one do you want to know? Okay. Right. Tell me which one? Um, I want to ask the third one. The third one is six hundred and okay. Tell me what is six hundred and sixty minus six? What is it? Ma'am, six hundred and fifty-four. Yes, so right. Ma'am, six hundred and fifty-four. Yes, write down six five four. <sighs> Then the fourth one down is four hundred and ninety six. And ma'am, the first answer is one nine hundred and sixty eight. Which one? Ma'am, first word block. Yes. Wait, wait, wait. Now everybody come to question number two. Everybody come to question number two. Question number two is which number is common only to the square and triangle? Now there are three figures made, and three of them are coming over each other. Mute yourself, Yuvraj. Mute yourself. we have so many figures like three figures a square a circle and a triangle and we have numbers written in we have numbers written in all these figures unsha mute yourself M twenty. Yes. So the first one is which number is common only to the square and triangle? Now, which is that number that is coming in square also and triangle also? Three. Three eight. No, not eight. Eight is eight is not coming in triangle. Ma'am, can ma'am, ma'am, five two, ma'am, five four, ma'am, five four. Better why five and four? Five and four. Okay, see everybody. Ma'am, three two. What is the question? Which number is common only to the square 
and the triangle which are the common numbers only to the square and the triangle what are those numbers Three. that are coming in triangle also Three. and square also 3 Three. 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 okay let's see Three. All right. It's only three. See, three is coming in square also and triangle also. Yeah, yeah. While two is coming in the circle also. So we will not mm. include two over here. Which the, number the, is common? It is no, number three. Three. Yes, sir. Three. Nine. दो भी आ रहा लेकिन ये सर्किल में आ रहा है इसलिए नहीं करते देन व्हाट विल यू गेट इफ यू ऐड द नंबर कॉमन टू द स्क्वायर द ट्रायंगल एंड द सर्कल टू द लार्जेस्ट नंबर इन द सर्कल नाउ व्हिच इज द लार्जेस्ट नंबर इन द सर्कल टेल मी 9 9 इज द लार्जेस्ट नंबर इन द सर्कल सो व्हाट इज द सम what will the addition be if you add what will the what will the answer be if you add the number common to all the three figures there is one mm -hmm. number that is common to all the three figures tell me what mm -hmm. is that number which number is common, common to all the three figures two two, two. two. yes two. two what will the answer be that 11 Very nice. Maybe eleven. The answer will be eleven. Eleven. Which number is common to all the three figures? It is number two that is common to triangle, square, and circle. And which is the largest number in the circle? That's number nine. So when we add two to eleven, sorry, two to nine, it becomes eleven. children have you understood yes ma'am ma'am but one is written beta one is written in the circle but they are saying to the largest number if you add two to the largest number given in the circle what is the largest one is the largest number in the circle no na no ma'am one is no, the smallest Which number is common to the square and circle, but not to the triangle? Common to the square. Now read it carefully. Which number is common to the square and the circle, but not to the triangle? That is number eight. Very nice. Very good. Eight. Eight. Good. Now, children, come to come to the next page now. Okay. Come to the next page now. We have look at the grid below and answer the questions that follow. First of all, you need to know since now many students have joined. and i hadn't explained so we have a grid a grid is made by columns and rows so first of all we need to know what is a row and what is a column who can tell me what is a row tell me ma'am vowel what is a row and what is a column tell me from left To right, to bottom. Okay. Ma'am, top to yes. bottom. Either row. Okay. No children. How you remember? Ma'am, column is left okay, to right. right. No better. Wait. Ma'am, it is row and to bottom is column. Yes. How you remember? Have you been to a movie theater? Have you gone? Have yes. you ever gone to a to a movie theater to watch movies? Who all have gone to mall to watch movies? Tell me. Ma'am, I. Everyone has gone. Has gone. Ma'am, in twenty twenty. 
not in 2020 in your uh, life i am no. asking till now yes sir i will go you have seen you have seen how a picture hall is yes in yes, that ma in that yes, picture ma hall ma'am be quiet everybody be quiet in that movie three hall times. in that movie hall we have got so many seats so how do you come to know about your seat you have a slip in your hand which tells you in which row you have to sit understood yes ma'am there are different rows a b c d e f g h like that there are different rows ma'am so the lines yes, that are placed like this one after another one behind the other are called rows okay and columns is this okay ma'am standing position rows is rows are what in lying down position in horizontal position write it down rows are sleeping lines and columns are standing lines fine yes ma'am no ma'am no ma'am i got not find All right, children. Have you found what are rows? Rows are in sleeping position. You know what is a sleeping line and standing line. And columns are standing lines. Fine. Hi. Yes. Now, now let us find out. Now let us find out which row of letters has all the vowels. Line number six. Line number six. L and F and Q. What? Who is this? Unsha, can't you mute yourself? Which row of letters has all the vowels? The answer that is given on the back is row number six. But if we see row number six, we have consonants also, right? S is a, is S a vowel? Yeah. S is a vowel? No. Oh. L is a vowel? No. No. Q is a vowel? No. No. The answer that is given at the back is wrong. There is there is no such row yeah. that has all the vowels. Valeria, okay, ma'am. Ma'am, I am joining late. Ma'am, what is page number? Page number fifty-one. Who has joined late? Who is the student? Okay. So the question. See, what do we understand from the question? Which row has got all the vowels? Are you thinking? Are we all no. thinking that all the alphabets should be vowels? There are only five vowels. Yes, all the five vowels are there in this row. What the question is? All the in which row we have all the vowels? It is not that every alphabet should be a vowel, but in that row all vowels mm -hmm. are there so do we have all the vowels in row number 6 yes do we have yes ma'am yes ma'am yes. yes, ma what are all the vowels who is going to tell me ma'am a e i o u a e i o u so in which row in which row all the vowels are placed Mathematics. Yes. Now, which row of letters has no vowels? 
which row no let's find out ma'am third row no 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 number 3 Second row, second row, second row, second row, second row. You see, everybody look very carefully. Only one row has got all consonants. There is not even a single vowel. Which is that row? Ma'am, second row. Come, ma'am, second row, third row. Hey, who are you? You call up. Are you ma'am third row? beta how come third row now see third row has got the last letter is i i is a vowel ma'am second row it is the second row second row has got ma'am seven consonants are there no basic line no what is the answer of second it's the second row now Read out the third one. Who is going to read out the third one? Yathar, read. Yes, ma'am. Which row of letters has only one co seven consonants? Row, row second, third row. Ma'am, third row. Ma'am, third row. थर्ड रो देर इज रिटन आई सो इट इज रॉन्ग भव्य लिसन टू मी दे आर आस्किंग विच रो हेज गॉट Seven consonants. So just count it. Row number three has got seven consonant. The eighth one is a vowel. The answer is three. The Maybe answer of the answer of two is two. The answer of third one is three. Okay. Me is special. I to vowel vowel है ना? Third one. Then the fourth one. Which column of letters has two A's? Which column? Which Now let's find out which. What are columns? Columns are standing position. Okay. Ma'am, six and eight. Ma'am, column one. Which column has got two A's? Everybody find out. Everybody look into your books. Ma'am, six and eight. One and two. And you will type in the chat box. Nobody will speak the answer now. Ma'am, call on first. Mute yourself. Mute yourself, all of you. Column first is the answer. Yes. Column one has got two A's. Then. Which two columns of letters have only one vowel? Now we have to see two columns where we have only one vowel. There are col columns column given. Two. Let's find out column which column has six. only one vowel. Column number six. Then okay. Column number five. I told you to type in the yes. chat box. Okay. So I have found out the answer. Now let me see what your answer is. Eighth column. Yes, very good. Eighth column has only one vowel, and column number six has also got only one vowel, and column rest all columns have got more than one vowel. done so the answer is 6 and 8 then which row of letters constitutes the first row of letters on a standard computer keyboard okay now let me make you understand this line which row of Let's letters 
which row no, of beta wait 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 which row of letters constitute the first row of letters on a standard computer keyboard on a standard computer keyboard what what is the first row of letters tell me ma'am q then column and it is a, on present or okay. grade okay. 7 let rishav kumar say rishav kumar is raising his hand yes rishav kumar no ma'am by mistake ma'am by mistake i have okay by mistake now first row. first row no beta not the first row ma'am no, seventh ma'am seventh okay i'm saying a standard keyboard on a standard keyboard now everybody has got a phone in your hand you you all have got got your phones or laptops before you yes Yes, ma'am. Just, I just, got. Just everyone, each one of you, tap the keyboard, the keypad. From where you type, just tap yes, the keypad. Okay. Let's see. Let's come on WhatsApp and type the keypad. Now, what is the first row that we get? What letters do you see here? The letters are Q U E R T Y. But are not numbers. I'm talking about letters. Okay. What are the first three four alphabets? Q U R T Y. These are okay. Everyone, each one of you. These are known as QWERTY keypads. What do we call them? QWERTY. Why? Because we have Q U E R T Y. These are the letters that come in the first row. Now, which row has got Q U R T Y? Let's find out. There is one row where we have seventh row. Which row? Men seventh row. Yes, it is the seventh row. We have Q. We have U. We have T. We have R. Men seventh row. Yes, it is the seventh row. Okay, the next one. Which four columns? Of letters have three vowels. Oh which four columns of letters? Which four Let's columns five and seven. have three vowels? It is oh two, five and seven. Two, yes, five, yes, and seven. Very good. It's two, five, and seven. seven. They all have got three vowels each. Now and first one. First one has got only two vowels, beta. There are not three vowels. They're asking which column has got three vowels. Then the letters no, of no, which no, row? First one, there is three, three vowels. Okay, tell me which are those three vowels. Tell me. Well, A E U. Where is A E U? I can't see E anywhere in the first column. Can you see E? The first column has got letters no, A S V B F A Q N. These are the letters in the first column. So we have only two vowels there. Done? Which column? Sorry, the last one. The letters of which row? The letters of which row? Row is this, the sleeping one. Form the word slip. Which row? See, which row has got alphabets that the word slip will be formed? That means Ma that column, that Ma row. Yes, that row has to have alphabets S L I P. Now let's find out where we have S L I P. Ma'am, I have sent the answer in chat box. Very nice, Vita. Very good. All of you have found out? All of you have found out? Ma'am, eight. Eight. It is the eighth one. 
मैम वो चीज़ फिफ्थ वन ओके रीड आउट द फिफ्थ वन बेटा What is the fifth one? Read out the fifth one. Ma'am, question. Yes, question. Which two columns of letters have only one vowel? Now find out. Try to find out. Okay, ma'am. See, tell anybody else who can tell. Ma'am, no. Which two columns of letters have only one vowel? It is the answer is six and eight. Done. I can read six. Yes, read out. Read out the sixth one. Ma'am, no. ma'am, I yes. have got the eighth answer. Eighth answer. Have you got the eighth answer? Yes, it is. It is the the eighth answer is because A only because in the columns in sorry in the rows we have seen the the last line eighth for in the last last there is S and and then. In the second there is L, in third there is I, and in in fifth there is P. Yes. So it is me. Good. Four of letters constitutes the first row of letters on a standard computer keyboard. Ah, uh, beta, you are asking this question. Two. Okay, on a standard C, children. For this one, you need to know that what letters are there on a standard keyboard in the first row. Every keyboard is same. Every keyboard is same. So the first row of the keyboard has got what? How do you learn it? We call it QWERTY keypad. QWERTY. It is called the QWERTY keypad. Keypad. Why? Because when you look at these letters, the letters are Q, W, E, R, T. Why? QWERTY. Now, which row has got all the alphabets of a keypad? Find out that row where you have alphabets like Q W. Sorry, Q W E R T Y. Understood? Understood? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Mom. Now see what yes, is written. What is written at the bottom of page number fifty-one? What is written? Just read it out. A sentence. No, the last thing that is written in orange color. This one. Read out this one. Read out on your own. That has all twenty-six letters of the alphabet is called a pangram. Yes. A pangram. Pangram. And what is written on page number fifty? Read out that also. An octet is a group of eight people or things. Or things. Anything that has got eight. That is called a octet, right? Octet is a, a, group a figure of with eight, eight corners. Eight what is a figure with eight corners called? Then what is octet? Octet is a group of eight people or things. Like if we talk about shapes, a shape that has eight corners is called a an octagon. Similarly, a group of eight people is called oct.